Welcome back to Midnight Suns. Let's continue on with Storm. Ammo coil. One epic blueprint. Nah, I don't really need anything like this. See you soon. I think Dahlia might be hiding with the Morlocks. The Morlocks? Mutants who live in the tunnels beneath the city, and who stay away from the X-Men. There's a homeless encampment by an entrance to the Morlock tunnels. Vampires have attacked it three times this week. That cannot be a coincidence. Do you think the vampires are hunting this child? I don't know. The city's most vulnerable population is being erased. Mutants and humans alike. Disappearing from shelters, off the streets. The vampires go after anyone the world would not miss. Or even notice. Until now. Okay, so we do bring Hunter, um... I think Magic had pretty good synergy with, uh, Storm. But let's double check. So, Storm, you are... Chain, Forceful Knockback... I think I just increased Storm's strength. So, a lot of knockback. Dark Child would be a good one to absorb. Uh, some damage. I don't know that Wanda would be great. Let's go with my girl Magic. Like too vulnerable to all Lilin. I don't think that's gonna do anything for me. Let's grab some Vampiric Essence instead. Because we need some healing. Knocked into a drop. Eh. Symbiote Bind. Bomb instead. Nobody has anything to say. All right, then. Another feeding frenzy mission. Now it's the city's unhoused population. These depraved creatures have no shame. They do not seem to feel anything at all. Only their hunger drives them. And yet they're still on the trail of Dahlia, with these people caught in their wake. Then you're in the right place. At the very least, you can deny the vampires their next meal. 
Okay, uh, my dog is freaking out, so I'll be right back. All right, we're back. So, what do we have here? Got a hero combo. Two of these idiots. This will certainly help. Won't even kill him. Maybe you do not realize the trouble you are, friend. Oh, we can just do this. This will have to do. Seriously, bro? You know what? Let's do call to arms. Should have done it earlier. The advantage is mine. Wait, why is this still only showing one? The fuck? Well, that's bug. Oh, now it says two. Okay. To the skies. The elements empower me. Chose this path. Now you must follow it. Even in a city as renowned as New York, these people have still been left behind. The is lack of empathy is not unique to this city or this time. Society often turns its back on those who are different. And those with unusual abilities are even more likely to be shunned. Yes, we've all felt it in one way.
Hunter, but I'm not too concerned about her. Are they not gonna go? Because we still have a lot of turns until their feeding frenzy is over. Or until their feeding frenzy kicks off, I mean. I had heard you were more than just a gatekeeper. Did attack. I must have missed the uh, notification. We're fortunate these are resourceful people. Most of them must have escaped before things got bad. To survive like this, they must always be looking over their shoulders. Let us hope that is what happened. Too weak for this fight. Return to the darkness. I will deliver. Get it out, everybody. All right. Let them watch. Give them no cause to fear us. Shh. It's all right. You'll be as good as new. Dahlia? Aurora? What are you doing here? I tried to find you at the orphanage, but... But what? It seemed you were in distress. I wanted to help. I'm not the one who needs help. Look around you. I can do more here than wearing a fancy yellow suit. The Morlocks took me in. They just welcomed me into their family. But now someone is trying to tear our family apart. I am so sorry. No, you're not. You say you're all about protecting mutants. But it's only the ones who live in that mansion. You don't even see people like us. That's not true. What happened here? We were attacked by creatures. We don't know what they are or what they want. Most of us fled after the last attack. Some are too wounded to move. 
I just need more time to heal them. What can we do? You really want to help? Stop those things from killing my family. These vampires are truly stockpiling victims. There is something much greater at work here. As if the torment of these people was not enough. It is never enough. There always seems to be a darker purpose waiting to reveal itself. At least it keeps us busy. Oof. Um... Do a limbo portal. Stun me. Oh wait, did I play any attack? Should have done call to arms. God damn it. I'm fucking that up. It's not giving her bleed. Normally the status effect seemed to happen regardless of having Dark Child. survived by avoiding unnecessary attention and much like their counterparts on the surface many people do not want to see them the modern world continues to surprise them i can expect it better Yeah. 
this world alone and forgotten. Not bad. Some for the rest of us. Rising Storm attacks and heroics have a ten percent O to apply stun. I see, I see, I see. Well, he's stunned, but... Oh, wait. You know what? We can end this. Let's, um... Switch to Hunter. I forgot we had a bunch of extra moves. You won't survive another encounter. It's just shoves that we didn't have a lot of. But we only have one. Dahlia, it's over. You're safe. Thank you, Aurora. And the rest of you. We're not used to people looking out for us. Is there anything else we can do? No. We'll be alright. I've healed the others. We'll move where they can't find us. Dahlia. You don't have to be alone. The X-Men would welcome you. Thanks, but... I'm not alone. And I can't abandon my family for yours. All right. And if you ever need me... You'll be the first we call. Goddess be with you. All of you. Hunter, I have a favor to ask. What do you need? Storm seems... off. I haven't seen her like this before. Can you speak with her? Of course, but why me? You both know what it means to lead. 
she sees you as a peer, whereas I will always be her student. You may be able to reach her in a way I cannot. All right. I will seek her out. Thank you. Oh, and don't tell her I asked you to do this. But let's first join a hangout. Let's we could probably max out with Wanda. You know that I was supposed to replace you, right? Agatha wanted me to be the new hunter. I may have heard something about that. Well, I never thought I could replace you. I wanted you to know. You are the Scarlet Witch. You are the first to recover from my mother's corruptive touch. Only with your help. You fought her with everything you had. I could not have brought you back otherwise. That's nice of you to say. Even if I had the skill to replace you, I couldn't have done so in Sarah's eyes. She never let me forget it. That does sound like Sarah. It's fine. What's important is that you are here, so you can be who we all need you to be. Everyone is where they need to be. You most of all. You said it better than I, and that's my point. Scientifically minded. I know that she likes meat, sports cars. Um, BT way. I don't think she would like that. Um, this one's in leadership. I mean, this seems like it would be for Captain America. I mean, this, she might like something that would also suit Doctor Strange. Uh, just a uh, bittersweet tune. Uh, this calls us back to a simpler time. Why One of not? My favorite activities. Oh, she liked it. Well, whatever. Okie dokie, and then the last thing, we need to talk to Storm. Or is she outside? You can grab a coffee and pet a cat in the same shop. You were right about the Abbey being special. It's beautiful out here. I like to come here when I am feeling down. <laughs> Subtlety is not your strong suit. You want to ask about Dahlia, yes? Dahlia believes you only care about the X-Men who choose to join. Her words hurt you. Not exactly, but they've left me to wonder. And the act of self-reflection is often... uncomfortable. I do not follow. Her comment has caused me to think about how I treat my students. I don't think I choose favorites, but what if I do without realizing it? Regardless, I'm relieved to see her safe and happy with her found family. I'll keep worrying about her until the vampires are taken care of. I relate. The Midnight Suns are my family, and I share the same concerns over their safety. That almost sounds silly, worrying about people with powers. But I appreciate your words. It feels good to know I am not alone. I think the fear is natural. Having abilities puts targets on our backs. That is a good point. And just because we are strong does not mean we are invincible. <laughs> Where were you when I was a teenager? That's what leadership is. Knowing when to step in and when to respect boundaries. How do you know? They'll straight up tell you, or you'll just feel it. Sounds complicated. It gets easier with time. Thank you for coming to check on me, Hunter. Leaders often have to take these burdens on by themselves. I, I am not a leader. Oh, please. I call it like I see it.
Okay, does she He's actually there. have something else to say? Oh. I have never heard of a Morlock before. Morlocks are mutants who are visually distinct. I'm hesitant to call them different, but they avoid the X-Men. Different? Some Morlocks may have a gelatinous body, while others have horns growing from their head. Again, visually distinct. How did you meet Dahlia? I learned of her through the X-Men. Once mutants hit a certain age, their powers manifest. I went to offer Dahlia a place at Xavier's school, but she turned me away. Was that the only time you approached her? No. The second time I tried, the orphanage told me she had run away. I'm thankful she found companionship among the Morlocks. Do you think the vampires are after Dahlia or the Morlocks? It's hard to say. I do not know what they would want with either of them. Dahlia and the Morlocks are both mutants. Maybe the answer lies there. It's possible there's a connection there. I'd rather destroy the vampires before we find out for certain. No, that was all. Of course. Okie dokie. Well, this seems like a good place to end it. I hope you enjoyed this video. I'll see you in the next one.